All right, I'm excited to look through this bucket of dolls and toys. Um, a friend of mine works at a thrift store, and she sent me a message, and I got to see a little bit of it, but she asked me would I want this bucket of dolls, and she said um, she'd sell it to me for $5. So I went on and sent her the money, and I just got it. And um, I'm excited to go through it. I see some, some really good ones in here, so I'm just going to start. And remember, I paid $5 for this whole bucket. Um, it's a little Dorothy doll from Wizard of Oz, which is pretty cool. Then, let's see what else we have. We have Scarecrow from Wizard of Oz. Let's see if the rest are in here. We have, see, just a Barbie, probably from the late 70s or early 80s. Their dress on. Let's see what else. Another Barbie from the 70s or 80s. Another Barbie from the 70s or 80s, okay? It's not bad. Got a um, Jill and the Hologram dolls. I don't know if that's her original outfit or not. Um, I think this is one of the ones that when she has batteries, she um, her earrings light up. Let's see what you push. Don't know what you push. Anyway, a Jill doll. Let's put her there. Pretty good so far for $5. Um, goodness, I don't know who th these girls' names are, but she's from Jim and the Holograms, one of the myth misfits, and, um, I don't know if that's her original guitar or not. You'll have to let me know in the comments if you, probably, like, Pizzazz or Stormer. I just don't know their names. She looks like she has bracelets and shoes. That That's probably worth $5 by itself, probably 10 or 15 Ah! I know who this one is. This is Darcy Covergirl. Um, she's from the late 70s, I believe. Her hair is in really good shape. Wow. Let's see who this is. Have a nude doll, probably from the 70s or 80s. Her hair is pretty good to be so old. Just needs to be brushed. Hmm. Don't know who she is. She's probably old. She, hmm. A lot of dolls are five bucks. Hmm. I don't think she's old. I think uh, I think she's newer. Okay. Goodness, I have no clue who she is. She looks like she's the size of like a skipper. Maybe she is a skipper. If anybody knows who she is, if you'll just let me know. Okay, another Barbie from the 70s or 80s. She's in a gold swimsuit. I think that is a Barbie swimsuit. Brush her hair out. She's pretty good. Ah, I got a Dolly Parton doll. Cool, from the 70s. Wow. Let's see what else. Got a little Sprite. I have to excuse my hand. I've been painting in the toy museum today. Yuck. <laughs> um, little Sprite from Rainbow Bright. Got some Care Bears down here. These are old. Wow. One, two Care Bears. Let's see what else. Three, four Care Bears. That's a good deal. What's this? Hmm. I don't know who he is. I've seen him before. I don't know who he is. If anybody knows who he is, let me know. Hmm. I love toys, I just don't know what they all are. Don't know who these little guys are either. We have wheels. That one. That one. And that one, okay. I don't know who these are, and I got the bucket. So let's see, I spent 50. No, I spent five dollars. Excuse me. Let's see what it's worth. Probably say a dollar for the bucket. These little guys are pretty cool. I would say they're worth a good five bucks by themselves. So six dollars. That dolly's worth probably ten. So be sixteen dollars. I don't know about these. We'll say three bucks for old Barbies. So that's sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two. 
29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, wow, say, I don't know, 30, 43, 44, 45, 45, we'll say 10, 55, wow, Probably not anything. 55. Hmm. 55. I bet she's worth about 15. So we'll say 70. Probably 75. Dorothy's probably worth 10. Probably $85 worth of dolls and stuff. That's pretty cool. Oh, well. I'll take it. I'm going to go clean them up and put them in different parts of the toy museum. So um, if you like going through the stuff I found, just subscribe at 701 Chris Shannon, and I'll catch you guys later. Bye. Hey, if you love finding toys and collecting toys or just looking at toys, make sure you follow us on Facebook at Mississippi's Totally Awesome Toy Museum. Follow our journey of creating the state's first giant toy museum. Or also, you can see all of our videos on YouTube at 701 Chris Shannon. Thanks so much, and we'll catch you later. Bye.